so uh, in this video i will show you how to connect this node mcu board with the sensor board so this sensor board consists of total five sensors uh, it has one analog and four digital sensors so analog we have this ldr as a light sensor and as a digital we have this humidity and temperature then read switch to detect the door position and we have power switch to detect the power on and off and at the end of the sensor board uh, there is some notations are given t l h r p and x so uh, h is the output from humidity sensor l is output from light switch r is output from read switch p is output from power switch so you have to use this inner four wires you don't have to use this extreme left and extreme right corner to make connection with this node mcu board you have to refer this sensor board connection table so as per table uh, these are the connections notations written on sensor board l h r and p and these are the pins of the node mcu board a0 d3 d2 and d1 so d0 d1 d2 d3 is over here and a0 is over here so uh, out of this 10 bunch of wire you have to use any of four wires so you can peel it out so uh, as per table first i will show you how to connect this l to a0 so l is a notation on sensor board and on node mcu it is a0 so a0 is over here so i am connecting one female end at this point so a0 is going to l so l over here so as per table i am now connecting the rest three wire h to d3 r to d2 p to d1 so d1 to p d2 to r d3 to h after this connection we have to supply power to the sensor board so for that purpose we are using this two pin wire so one end of this wire you have to connect to this node mcu board and one end to sensor board just make sure this uh, red of this wire you will uh, you are connecting to plus symbol on the both side so one end i am connecting over here so orange or red is going to the plus same uh, plus is at the bottom side and ground is at the top side so orange part i am connecting to plus side so after this connection you have to upload the program and you have to connect the power supply so first you have to get the power supply at this power adapter and to program you have to connect the usb cable thank you